The explosion is deafening. A boom of sound, followed by a distinct ringing in your ears. A soldier readies himself, while tanks and transport units flank his right and left. A jet screams by overhead in support of the ground units as the heat of the desert baits the infantry in their entrenched position. It's a war zone, or so it seems. The crowd watching from about 15 feet away certainly are entertained. We're out here at the um, Wendover Air Show watching the airplanes and um, hanging out, having a good time. I like airplanes and my husband really enjoys it and he loves it and trying to get myself into liking it a lot and I'm starting to and it's a good time. There's something about the month of September that turns the skies over the western United States into a hotbed of aerial activity. California has the Reading Air Show and the Capitol Show in Sacramento. In Reno, Nevada, the famous air races take over the sky, where jets and propeller planes race to the stratosphere trying to win first place. Just a few hours to the east in Wendover, Nevada, on the Utah border, acrobats command the air, while would-be flyers are given a chance to sit in the cockpit and begin their own journey into the world of aeronautics. It's something that, that not everybody does and everybody feels it's way too complicated and it makes you feel good when you think you can accomplish something like that. Pilots like Phil White, these air shows are one of the highlights of the year, offering not only the chance to see classic planes up close on the ground, but what they can do in the air as well. In the case of the Reno Air Races, the speed involved and the number of teams participating create an atmosphere not found outside a well-used hangar. With Wendover, the feeling is a bit different, replacing speed with history. Wendover Airport is really nostalgic. It's uh, a World War II base. It's where they trained to drop the atom bomb in the Second World War. And it's just really neat to be out here. And if nobody's ever been out here, uh, you need to come out and see it for yourself. It's a unique experience. The Reno Air Races will be going on September 16th to the 20th at the Reno Airport, while the Wendover Air Show is open to the public on September 26th. The sky has held mankind in its thrall since the dawn of time. And even after 100 years of aviation history, we are still captivated by the experience of flight. That is what these air shows are all about. Inspiring families to leave the world behind together. And though each event is unique with spectacles on the ground and in the sky, all of them open up the horizon for anyone wanting to take flight. People are all hooked together when you fly. Everybody enjoys flying and everybody likes aviation. And when you do fly, everybody's there to help you and work with you. You can come to an airport that you've never been to before and people are here to help you get down and get back up safely. It's just a nice community to be part of. From the aerial trailhead, I'm Joe Lee.